Hi everyone, it's Alison here at Band of Badges. I've got another unboxing video for you today. This is Lorcana Chapter 3, Into the Inklands, and I've got the gift set this time. And the gift sets are really nice. They come in this beautiful foil effect box. And this time, with Into the Inklands, the colours have changed Lorcana. The previous two chapters were quite dark colours. This one's got a really nice sort of gold effect. I'm not sure if we're supposed to be in the land of sand or whether it's just changing it up so we've got gold for 2024 but it's really nicely made box you can, might be able to see that it's all foil and if I flip it over we can see what we're going to be finding inside so we've got small heroes big attitudes outside of outshine opponents with this gift set we like that foil cards featuring stitch and tinkerbell love tinkerbell Bring new options to your decks and the oversized foil versions are fun to collect and display. You also get four booster packs and tracker tokens featuring Stitch and Tinkerbell art. And it's good. you also get in here 32 damage counters uh, as well as the tracker tokens and the themed art. And it tells you a little bit about Stitch. And we have a bit about Tinkerbell here as well. So let's get straight into this. Now, the only thing with the gift sets is they don't make these as easy to open. So I kind of have to tear into it at the side. There we go. It seems such a shame to destroy the boxes, but we've got to get in and see what's there. Okay, we're in, we're in. Okay, this is made very much similar to chapter one and two, if you've had the gift sets from those. So it's another one that's gonna slide out. Okay. So these are gonna be our tracker tokens. And again, they're cardboard. And then we've got these life tokens as well. And we've got the um, Tinkerbell and we've got Stitch down here. And then, uh -huh, if we flip it over, out they come. There's the card packs. And on the back here, that's going to be our oversized cards as well as lots more tokens. So these are only always really good for the tokens. But I will say, also check out the video we're going to be posting up on the unboxing of the Trove because they've got some slightly different trackers and um, tokens going on in that. So change up from the previous chapters. So here we've got one, two, three, our four packs of boosters. And these are going to be our special cards. Let's start with the oversized cards. So we'll be able to have a really good look at those. Here we go. So these are two foil oversized cards. And when we say oversized, they're not quite as large as what you'd get in sort of a Pokemon style box set, but they are a larger version of the card. So you really see the details on them and hopefully you're seeing the foil effect as well. So there's Stitch and Tinkerbell. Okay, and if I open up the regular size version of the card to be able to see the difference in size. So these oversizes do make a nice collectible. There you go, you can kind of turn the right way around. And you can see the size difference on the cards to give you an idea of how big those oversizes are. So they are nice ones if you want to sort of have those cards on display of those key characters. And they're they're foils, both the regular size and the large size are foil cards. And then getting into the packs, we've got different character artworks on the front again. And I'm just going to open up one of the packs so we can have a look, see what we're getting inside this time. Okay, we've got some new instructions in the back there. Okay. So in here we've got, we've got Flotsam, uh, we have an action, Kick Cloud Kicker, I like that, another ally, so 
with some really nice characters coming through here. Oh, it's Patch. And these are the new cards that we're finding in Into the Inklands, which are these location cards. This is Tiana's Palace. And these are adding new dynamics to the game that weren't available in Chapter 1 and 2. Simba, this Lion King. Stitch again. So actually, that is the identical card. So you can see I've got both the regular and the foil, which came as the promo in the pack. And that's the foil card in the pack. Let's so hiss. And Robin Hood and then in the back here we've got the information on the new card type so we've got the information on the locations so this is a new game dynamic that's coming with chapter three and I think we have to I haven't had a chance to practice play any of this yet it'd be interesting to see how this fits together with the chapter one and two cards because the locations um, they're going to be played they go on the table in front of you like characters and items and only special location rules are explained here on this card so some of the locations give you a benefit and some give you lore. So if we look at the one we just found in the pack, let's see what we get with this one. So while this is in play, characters can't be challenged while here. So that could be quite a powerful card to use. So all of these locations are going to have different rules and give you different effects. And on the back here, they've given you an explanation of how those new cards are going to work which I think is going to be very handy. And then these are just further instructions. And also there's a new rule that's been introduced, which is this moving damage. So this is the ability to move damage counters from one character or location to another. Um, and these are effects that modify the amount of damage dealt, don't apply to damage being moved. So again, there's a couple of new game elements coming in in Chapter 3. So this is what you're getting in the gift set. It's a really nice box to kick things off. You get some great starter pieces as well as the promo cards. And I'll be doing some more unboxings on Locana Chapter 3. So check out our channel. Don't forget to subscribe. And thanks so much for joining me this time. See you on the next video. Bye.